Hey everybody, it's Eric and Piper for CC Cycle yeah. 3, week 24, English Grammar. It's the very last week of English Grammar, and it's seven sentence patterns. Oh yeah, and Luke's in the video with us, and Piper just had a sleepover at Luke's house. Luke is 20, and, uh, and he had his eight and a half year old uh, sister over for a sleepover. But anyway, seven sentence patterns. And we thought it would be a great idea for Piper to show you something she just made that involved patterns. So show them, Piper. So this is a forest, and the pattern here, as you can see, there's a, a bunch of different trees. But what she did, she had gel pens, which she loves. And she would close her eyes and pick out three colors. And then she would have to use those colors only for the tree. And then do it again, and then again. And that was the pattern. But this is seven sentence patterns. And I got to tell you, way back when, when Piper, four years ago, um, we did this, we did this for cycle three, and I thought to myself at this point, there is no way that anybody can ever memorize all seven sentence patterns. And then on YouTube, I found this incredible inspirational song, and we're going to do our version of that song right here. So I'm going to put that link below so that you get, so that the person who made this up gets the credit. Um, it's so good, and I think it probably inspired me to do the songs that I do at this point. So anyway, why don't we put that? Why don't we put that away for now? Okay, and we will. So, so again, it's seven sentence patterns. The melody is called "Turkey in the Straw," which is again one of those melodies that everybody knows, but doesn't really know that's what it's called. It goes ba ba dim ba ba dum ba ba dee ba dee ba doom ba ba dim dum da ba doo ba dee ba doo ba doo dee doo 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 doo. All right. I suppose we have a turkey with us. So. We're going to sing this about three times because there's a lot going on here. So here we go. <laughs> subject, verb, subject, verb, direct object, subject, verb, predicate, nominative, subject, verb, predicate, adjective, subject, verb, indirect object, direct object, subject, verb, direct object, object, complement, noun. Compliment, adjective. Now we'll do it a little faster. Here we go. Subject, verb, subject, verb, direct object. Subject, verb, predicate, nominative. Subject, verb, predicate, adjective, subject, verb. Indirect object, direct object. Subject, verb, direct object. Object, complement, noun. Subject, verb, direct object. Object, complement, adjective. You ready, Piper? Maybe that's too fast. Here we go. Subject, verb, subject, verb, direct object. Subject, verb, predicate, nominative. Subject, verb, predicate, adjective. Subject, verb, indirect object, direct object. Subject, verb, direct object, object, complement, noun, subject, verb, direct object, object, complement, adjective. Go, 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 That was an abrupt ending, and I did not make that up. I just think that song is pure brilliance, and I hope it hopes it helps you memorize all the seven sentence go, patterns at home. Go, go, so that's again go, Eric and go, Turkey for CC <laughs> Cycle 3, Week 24, English Grammar. Um, thank you so much to the original writer of this song. Props to you. That link is below. You know, go look at it. Tell her, tell her you like it. And uh, there's the pattern. Bye. <laughs>